All right, this is a video about how to remove the tumbler out of uh, an ignition switch for a 55 to 59 Chevy. Um, there's some videos on YouTube about this that I watched that did not explain this accurately, and it took me way too long to figure this out. I, I thought my ignition switch was defective or something like that, uh, but I finally figured it out, and I figured if I was having this trouble, some of you guys may as well. <clears throat> so basically what you've got here is you've got two little holes in your ignition tumbler. And basically you have to poke a paper clip down in those holes to release like this little detent pin to be able to remove the tumbler. So I've already got mine taken apart. So I'm going to pull this out and show you that this is this little brass uh, button right here is what you have to press to be able to remove the tumbler out. Um, so let me see if I can figure out how to show you this, hang on. So if you notice, there's two holes right there. So you have to turn your key to the far left accessory position, and then you poke a paper clip into this first hole and press the button which is gonna allow you to rotate the key a little bit further to the left. But what nobody tells you is then you have to press the paper clip in the second hole to press the button again to go ahead and release it the rest of the way. All right, nobody told me that. Everybody only told me you had to do it one time and I thought that mine was broken. Um, so anyway, that's why, that's why there's two holes. You have to release the lock twice. Good luck.